here to introduce to you Allison True. She is a freshman here at Anderson. She is a communications major with a focus in audio, video, cinema production. Allie likes to read books, listen to music, and watch movies. She is a part of the swing club here on campus. Allie wants to either have her own talk show or be an editor behind the scenes at a news station. Her dream is to be on Dancing with the Stars and have either Derek Huff or Mark Ballas as her dance partner. Today she is here to tell us why Harry Potter is better than Twilight. Hi. Most of us in this generation have grown up knowing about Harry Potter and Twilight in later years. My reasoning for why Harry Potter is better than Twilight is because Harry Potter teaches you to face your fears, it teaches you to the power of love, and the importance of friendship. My first reason for liking Harry Potter so much is that Ron Weasley faces his fear of spiders many times throughout the series. And I myself, I'm also a big arachnophobic. So, facing his fears of the spiders, he helps carry through many situations in the series. And then, in the first movie, Neville Longbottom stands up to Harry and Hermione and Ron in telling them that they shouldn't do what they're about to do to save the school. And it's a lot to stand up to your friends, and it can really shake your nerves. And then at the end, Neville stands up to Lord Baltimore, who's the evil person in the series. And he is able to overcome his fear and help defeat Lord Baltimore. And then Harry, he, 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 Harry faces his fear of death at the end and dies so that they can kill Baltimore. My second reasoning is the power of love. Harry's mom dies in Lord Baltimore's hands, and she dies to protect Harry because she loves him. And her love for Harry makes it to where Baltimore can't touch her, him, can't touch Harry, and it makes it harder for Baltimore to have the power to kill Harry. And then another power of love is Bellatrix restrains obsessive love for Lord Baltimore. Even though it's not a good love, it's still a type of love, and it turns out to be a bad thing for her and causes her to die again. And Molly Weasley has a protective love for her children, and she worries about them all the time, and she stresses about her children like any mother would. And Mo Molly Weasley shows to protect us for her children most during the Battle of Hogwarts when Bellatrix Lestrange tries to shoot her daughter Ginny Weasley with a killing curse and misses by an inch. And Molly Weasley go, she stands up to her and then kills Bellatrix instead of Bellatrix being able to kill her. And then Molly all but adopts Harry into her family with her love and her support for him. And then my third and final reason why Harry Potter is better than Twilight is because it teaches you friendships. Harry forms friendships with the people that most people wouldn't, like with Mooney Lovegood, or as her real name is, Luna, and Neville Longbottom, who's a timid, shy boy and is hard to talk to. Harry makes it to where he can become friends with anyone and he'll stand up and protect them. And Harry's ability to make friendships and to love people is what separates him from Lord Baltimore and makes him different, and while he is not the same. These are my reasonings for why Harry Potter is better than Twilight. Because Twilight just teaches you that if you have a man to protect you, nothing is going to go wrong.